Hi guys, so do you constantly feel like your attention is being pulled in all different directions? Yep, I know that feeling. I am constantly being bombarded with all these new ideas and thoughts and things to do and it just keeps adding more and more to my plate. Yeah, the struggle is real. Well, use this six step guide that I use in my business to help you prioritize your work. You might be surprised about how quickly you start to tick things off your list. Hello and welcome to another episode of the Side Hustlers Handbook. I'm Kate Emily, your go-to girl for marketing and business tips to help you hustle smarter, not harder. If that sounds like it's just for you, click the big subscribe button right here and so you can subscribe to all my weekly videos. Want to be more productive in your business? Of course you do, but without understanding your priorities, you can't actually set a foundation for completing tasks based on what is most important for you to do right now. These are the things that make us feel most fulfilled and really reflect our true purpose but are often pushed aside because of those little things that keep coming up that are really super urgent. Am I right? If you feel like you're spinning your wheels when it comes to never achieving your goals, you need to ask yourself, what is most important to me? Think about the things that really matter to you, whether that be in your personal life or your career. Are you mixing up what you believe to be urgent over what you know is important. Follow this six step guide with me right now. Make sure you pause the video whenever I give you a new step to complete um, and let's do this together. Step one is write down your goals. Write down all the goals you can think about that you wanna achieve in the next three months. Whether that be you know going for a hike with your partner or whether it be you know, achieving something in your business, write them all down right now. Step two is highlight the most important goals. So I'd like you to add a star next to five of your top priority goals. So these are the things that you'd love to achieve in the next three months. You might be a bit torn between a few of your goals, but please just pick five. Step three is cross off anything that's no longer important. So by highlighting the top five priorities, you may be thinking some of these other goals aren't that important anymore. So it doesn't mean that you're never gonna achieve these goals. It just means they're not your priority for the next three months. So by deleting what's no longer important, that's gonna help you to really keep focused on the things that are. Step four is circle the goal that is most important. So this is the one thing if you could achieve anything on your list, this is the one thing that you want to achieve the most. Step five is write down three actionable tasks. So these are the three critical steps towards achieving your goal. And by breaking it down like this, it makes achieving your goals way more approachable. Step six is complete one now. So right now I challenge you to pause this video and to complete one of your actions. This will mean you're not adding it to your to-do list, it doesn't get put on your pile of more things to do. It is gonna get done right now. So now you've completed one task towards achieving this month's biggest goal. How good does that feel? So keep repeating these steps for all five of your top priority goals for the next three months. So here's a hot tip for you. Reach out to a friend or family member and share your goals with them. They'll help you to stay on track and to make sure that you're focusing on the priorities and what's important to you, not just what's urgent. If you've completed one task towards achieving your goal or you're planning to do so right after this video, Comment below with Side Hustler. I'd love to see how many of you are inspired to take action right now. I'd love to connect with you on Instagram so I can see what you're up to in your Side Hustler journey. 
so come on over and give me a follow. Here is where I chat candidly about my own side hustler journey, give marketing and business tips, as well as give some insight into who Kate Emily is behind the scenes. I'll pop the link below, so come over and say hi. If you like this video, please give it the thumbs up. It really helps my channel and I'd love to see if you really love this video and whether it's something that you're going to start implementing in your own life. So I release videos every Tuesday, so make sure you subscribe as I'll be sharing more marketing and business related tips for side hustlers and I'd love you to continue this journey with me. Thank you so much for watching and until next time side hustlers, bye for now.